Hello everyone, welcome back again to Mufasuke channel with GW3D 3D modeling basic tutorial how to create a 3D computer deck. First, we can create a new part. And in here, I will click sketch and use this blue plan. Click OK. We can draw rectangle object, click at this point. And I will move uh, to this point. You can set for width into 2 and then for height into 60. OK. Next, I will use a copy command to copy this rectangle object. So you can click basic editing and click copy. You can click in a drop down uh, menu and click uh, this option copy. For entities, you can select uh, these objects. And for direction, I will set into x axis. You can use uh, this option uh, copy entities along a direction and I will change this 10 into 120. You can click OK to apply. We can close this sketch. And then I will use extrude command to extrude uh, this profile. We can set for extrusion into 75. Okay. The next I will create a rectangle object at this face. You can click sketch and we can select at this face. Okay. Use a rectangle command to create a rectangle start from this point. And I will move into this point. Now we can close sketch and I will extrude this rectangle object with uh, extrusion minus 2 you can uh, click this profile for extrusion we set into minus 2 okay the next i will uh, create again a rectangle object in a this face you can click sketch and i will select at this face you can click a rectangle command and i will click at uh, this point move into this point i will set for height in here into minus 50 and you can click OK. Now we can uh, extrude again with minus 2 this uh, profile. I will combine this all object by using edit shape. You can click here and then you can click add shape. For base, I will select uh, this uh, objects and for edit, I will select these three objects. You can click OK to combine. We already create these simple models. The next, I will create cabin in uh, this position. You can click sketch and I will select at this face. Click OK. I will create a rectangle object. Okay, you can click at this point. We move into this point. For width in here, I will set into 40. And for height, I will set into 64. Okay. Next, I will use uh, offset command. We can offset this line objects. And you can use uh, flip the direction. We activate uh, this option. We click at uh, this uh, cube. Okay, you can click in here and we click at uh, this cube. Select object. You can click. Okay. The next, I will create line object. Start from this point and move into here. We create again. Start from this point. Move into this point. You can click. Okay. We can use this uh, quick dimension to create this turn from uh, this line into here. We set in here into 18. We set again this turn from this point into here into 18. Okay. okay. We cancel. I will undo. And in here I will delete uh, this uh, snap. We delete again in here. And we can set in here into 18. Okay, now I will use offset command to offset uh, this line's object. You can click sketch and we can click offset command. Select these objects. We can OK. We offset again in here and I will use a uh, flip the direction. Click OK. Now the last we can uh, use a trim command. You can click uh, in here. One touch trim. I will trim this line objects in here. You can trim again in here. Click OK. You can close this cat and I will convert this cat into 3D models with a uh, extrusion command. You can uh, click this extrude and for profile, we select this profile. Okay. Now for uh, sketch option profile, I will click in here and I will select in uh, this uh, face. You can click OK. The next uh, we can uh, change for extrusion into minus 45 click 
okay we also can use excel command and i will select this profile step 4 you can use this option and in here we can select after this face okay we extrude with minus 2 the last four handles i will create a rectangle object at this face you can click uh, sketch select this surface the next uh, we can create a rectangle objects i will create a rectangle in here and i will set for width into two for height into two the next you can copy these objects okay you can click in here copy select uh, these objects and i will set for a direction into minus x axis okay you also can change in here to this point and i will set into 13 minus 13 okay this is for minus 13 click ok the next i will move uh, this object you can click basic editing and use a uh, move command select uh, these uh, two entities i will move from a point to point you can click here and for first point i will use a between option we can click in it and click in it the next we can use between option again you can click in here and you can use between we click at this point and move into this point click ok the last we can select again with a move or command we can select all these objects and i will move in uh, this uh, option move entities along a direction for direction you can set into y axis here i will move into this uh, point you can set into two okay this for two you can click apply close sketch and we convert into 3d models this uh, rectangle objects you can use extrude command for profile you can select this profile and for extrusion we can set into three Okay, this three apply the last i will create a rectangle object in this face you can click sketch select this face use a rectangle command to create a rectangle from this point into middle point and apply the last we can use extrusion again to extrude this profile into this direction Okay, you can set in here for uh, uh, extrude type i will set into one side and then for extrusion in here we can set into 13 okay, this is for 13 so i will set in here into 11 okay this is for 11 apply the last we can combine these all objects by using add set select uh, this uh, object for base and for add you can select these two objects apply this object already combined now we can copy this object, you can click basic editing and click copy. I will use a point to point. For entity, we can select this object, combine 8. And for from point, I will click in here. We can move into here and the last in here. Okay. Now we already create this simple 3D models computer decks with ZWTD2020. If you have any question about this uh, tutorial, you can comment below this video.